Hey guys, what's going on? So I'm doing a video over how nicotine and smoking basically affects your brain. All right, this is where it all starts. This is where the addiction starts. Okay, this is where it becomes rooted in your brain. All right, sucks, but that's how everything happens. All right, that's what happens with every addiction. It's it starts with the brain. So what happens? You're smoking a cigarette. You get nicotine. You do it for a little while, and your brain starts making e extra nicotine receptors, okay, to accommodate for the extra dosage of nicotine that you're getting. Which nicotine, by the way, if you didn't know, it is just as addictive as heroin. Pretty interesting statistic right there, if I have to say so myself. So, yeah, that's pretty alarming. So, it basically comes up with these extra receptors in your brain to accommodate for the extra doses of nicotine that you're giving your body. Okay, so when your brain stops getting the nicotine that it needs to or what it used to get, you're going to have withdrawal symptoms which keep you from doing it, which can also opt you to increase your level of nicotine that you're getting into your body. So therefore, you can become anxious, you can become irritable, you know, you can have intense urges for nicotine because you got all these extra receptors and you're not feeding its, its you know, it's a drug. Okay, so that's why and how it'll affect your brain. Okay, guys, so you're rooting addiction right there. And that goes for a lot of other addictions, including like alcohol is another big one that, that happens. Okay, so like this video, comment down below if you got a story, if you need any advice about smoking or how to quit. Also subscribe to my channel. I've got a lot of great videos on how to quit smoking and other forms of tobacco, also alcohol, drugs, and I also have tits on... Uh, stress and anxiety. So check out my channel. Please subscribe guys. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck on your journey.